go up to actions and then find the create text with GPT and drag it in. We can have the GPT engine to generate text messages for us. That could be to answer emails or support messages. So here I'll say and answer the support message colon two new lines and that could be something like hey IT support. I cannot send or receive emails in Outlook. Please help. Yes, a very short message. We want to create an answer with that and we want to have it done by the GPT. The variables produced that will be the predict v2 response and the one we're looking for is the predict v2 text response. Here we will have the answer. If I click save, save here, Microsoft requires you to have a human in the loop. So we need to have a display message. I will show you how to bypass this. So stay tuned in the video. But first, let's do it in the right way. So here I'll say message to display. I'll find the predict v2 text response by clicking the X over here. I double click it. Now we have it. Also take the keep message box always on top. So we know we have it in front. I will click save. Try to run this and soon we will have an answer to our support message. So right now the GPT engine is here. Check your internet connection, restart, you know, all the support lingo and update. And otherwise we can uh, provide more details about the message. So that one was straight, straightforward, but it is a pain that we need this display message after each one of the answers. But what you can do, let me finish this one, is to open up this display message. Go down here to close message box automatically. Click this and then in the timeout, choose zero, click save and now try to run it. And this will take text to uh, this will take time to create the text and you will not have this display message pops up, but it still need to be there. But if you go over here to the predict v2 text response, then we have it as a variable, we can put it in an email. Let me show you a real example. We will do sentiment analysis. Go watch this video. That will be a real use case using the create text with GPT in Power Automate desktop.